Economics. Money. Business. Hey friends, it's Kelly again. Today we're gonna learn about business and selling to sellers. What does that mean? Well, usually businesses would sell directly to their customers or consumers, but sometimes they go the other way around. The main seller, which is the wholesaler, would sell to a retailer, retailers, and then they sell to the customer. But sometimes, the wholesaler sells to the retailer, then it's、uh, then the retailer sells to even smaller businesses, and then they sell them out. But nowadays, usually it just goes straight to the consumer. And here's also a tip on marketing. Like if you're selling bars of chocolate, but in large amounts, like one bar, is,、uh, one bar is approximately this long, this wide, then you have lots of them. But you can't sell them fast enough. You're only selling ten bars a day, and you only charge three dollars for each one. So you're not making much money. Let's say five dollars for each one, but then eight dollars for each one, and、uh, people would be unhappy. Of course, you would get more money, but people wouldn't buy it. They'd be put off. If you sold it for one dollar, geez, that's cheap. You'd lose money. So five dollars it is set on five dollars. But if somebody came along like a retailer person, then if the retailer said to buy like six hundred of your chocolate bars, the retailer could also lower the price to three dollars per chocolate bar. And that is a good deal actually, since they're buying so many. Later on, the retailer sells them for like five dollars again, cause, well, they got it for three dollars. Then they earn a two dollar profit for each one. And then later on, the smaller businesses also sell it, and then, eventually, to the consumer, the eaters. All right, that's all we have for today. Goodbye. See you next time. So, 跟常荣学英语的其他节目，谢谢收看和点赞。